We're taking it for a test drive to see if it works. Yes! Pee all day, boy! <laughs> <laughs> well, today, ladies and gentlemen, we have a Jeep. And the Jeep has a massive flaw. It's like -da 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 when you're driving down the road. Gabe, why did your Jeep sound so terrible? Dude, I have no idea. Yeah, I mean, it always sounds terrible, but if it ever sounds this terrible. Ah, well, well that's, a, that's a project for tonight. I guess we're going back home. <laughs> Dude, that sounds so bad. Thing sounds like crap, doesn't it? <laughs> well, the neighbors agree, it does sound like, like crack, yeah. Gear. Right, let's see what this thing is. This back one's good. This one's leaking. Oh wait, that's <laughs> lots of mud. That's that's glittery mud water. That that will have to get fixed. <laughs> and it needs bearings. We'll have to rebuild that front end. Wait. <laughs> well, that... there's Whoa! your problem. <laughs> there's your problem. Well, here's what I think. All the bearings in there that were there are gone now. <laughs> huh. This drive shaft has like. <laughs> Dude, how is it? Wow. <laughs> Interesting. Ah, dude, it's like, so oh, that's wow. the drive shaft? Yeah, it's the yep. front drive shaft. Transfication is oh. here. The transmission from the motor puts the power into the transmission, into the transfer case, where in two-wheel drive, it puts the power into that back axle. But when you put it in four-wheel drive, it also splits the power between the rear drive shaft, the front drive shaft, over to this front axle, which operates the four-wheel drive. But this is supposed to be very balanced. Like kind of like that one back there to where you can't, you can't wiggle it. Like when you wiggle it, it's solid. Solid. Look at this bad So place. why is it making the noise even in two wheel driving? Uh, well, because it still spins. It's just not connected to this. So like there's no power going through, but this still has to spin because this is connected with gears, right? So the axle is connected to the drive shaft and then the drive shaft goes into the transfer case. But when the transfer case not, isn't engaged, those gears aren't, aren't engaged in there so it'll still spin but it just doesn't it's not just not getting any power so so it's still it's going to make the noise no matter what and that's why i think that's probably why it's less in uh four wheel drive because when it's in four wheel drive there's a little bit of torque on it and so it doesn't have as much wiggle room that's my guesstimation anyway pretty good estimation michael favorite thing about your car is these screws sticking <laughs> oh yeah that's where <clears throat> we don't look at those <laughs> actually if you want to see a real piece of art you can see let me give me this, give me this. <laughs> <laughs> you can see various quite, quite large rust holes. <laughs> but don't worry, we got perfectly good chimney to fix it. Yes, we <laughs> got some. Welder. Michael Lee and I got <laughs> stove pipe. <laughs> and I know how to weld now. <laughs> so what we figured out is the front drive shaft, the UV joint is all loose and wobbly. So we're gonna pull the drive shaft out and then we're gonna drive it again without the drive shaft. And if it still makes the noise, we'll know that wasn't the problem or it was, well, it was part of the problem. All right, what are we doing, Gabe? <sighs> Trying to break these bolts, which uh, surprisingly are breaking nicely. Oh, you know what also broke nicely? This Jeep. These UV joints, yeah, it's also broke nicely. <laughs> Look at them all sloppy in there. Wiggle it for us real quick. <laughs> Pretty sure it's not supposed to do that. It might have actually worn it to the point where we just need to like re no return. <laughs> replace that whole knuckle or whatever it Imagine is. Imagine we have to replace this, which might mean like more parts in transfer case have to be replaced as well. Ooh. Hey, hey Matthias. I'm safe. <laughs> is this so nice because we don't have to- Look at that. Safety first, guys. <laughs> uh, yeah, 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 you do yeah, that, yeah, you'll yeah, be really yeah, safe. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Oh, uh, Matthews, if you want to put it in neutral and roll it forward just a smidge and deedle. Wait, hold on, 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 text message. His mom? Yeah, it's probably his mom telling him good night. Little heart emoji. Uh, -huh. uh I don't really know what happened, but basically we got the uh oh no, here's the rest of it. Oh uh, we got this apart. There were a bunch of beating and hammering and smashing and 
Uh, basically, I think it's kind of destroyed and they're gonna need a new drive shaft. But we're gonna try to drive the Jeep now and see if it works with just the rear drive shaft. So no four wheel drive. Your joints don't work! Oh wait, problem <laughs> solved. <laughs> Week. It works just fine now. Let's do it. Well, I guess we know what's wrong. Put in four-wheel drive. I'm <laughs> <laughs> And that's going to do its thing. Your now four-wheel drive is just me and Matt just getting out and pushing. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Works like a shower, boys! What did I tell you? Bluetooth all the way! <laughs> what it's like owning an XJ? Well, when your drive shaft starts rattling, you install that old Bluetooth, boy! <laughs> Works like a charm, boys! What did I tell you? Bluetooth all the way! <laughs> First thing we did after yanking the axle out was come take it out to a mud pit and try to get it stuck. <laughs> so we're so smart, guys. <laughs> this is smart 101 right here. <laughs> Shell painted? Help! Help! He's kidnapping me! He's kidnapping Stop you. Off. Well, at least he has the five high dispatch. Look at how high viz that is. It's like darkness except for that. Well, looks like we should go hide now. So, uh, well, we've been stranded out here in the wilderness, but thankfully we have a high viz vest so that we won't get hit by deer. Yeah, Gabe, uh, we ran away to try to run away from Gabe, but I realized I have a high viz vest on. And there's a fence. And uh, we hit this fence right here and I smashed it with my mouth. I think I'm maybe bleeding a little bit. I can't tell. It's no, you're fine. Uh, up by your nose. <laughs> Who cares? But yeah, uh, mission failure. Massive failed on our part. But such a loser. You can't even get up the hill. Never mind. He can. Yes. He all day, boy. I think that's all for tonight, guys. We did the thing. Pulled the drive shaft. Almost got her stuck, and are heading home now. And so. then. They're leaving for California soon, so yeah. uh, probably won't be fixed for a while, but we'll see. Well, just pulled into the old junkyard, risk easy pick and pull. They got a couple of those uh, XJs in here. We're gonna go ahead and pull a drive shaft off one of them. Slap her right back in and we'll be in four wheel drive, my boy. Awesome. You already know. <laughs> Luxury. <laughs> All right, so this was what went bad on that one that we got off of ours. It was uh, in here, there's like a big bearing and wore out and then these CVs wore out as well. And actually kind of ended up grenading at some point and it chewed up the rest of it and it wasn't good. But now, <laughs> Gucci. Yes, sir. I'm no axle expert. Wait, it looks like it's been rubbing. Look at that. Look at look at those bolts it did. It looks like they've been rubbing up against that. Yeah, I'll bet you all this was. I wonder if there's a way to fix that. I wonder if this was supposed to have like a bigger lift kit on it than what the guy could afford for shock. <laughs> this link is the original Jeep link. Look at the difference. This is beef. This is like a little piece of folded tin. <laughs> Somebody had some extra tin foil laying around and decided to make a Jeep out of it. Dude. Guys! Running well. <laughs> Don't put that in. <laughs> Don't put that in. I'm not actually like that. I'm not actually like that. IRL boys. No. We're, we're yes. serious. He really is like that. So yeah, front uh, drive shaft was a good success. Okay, front drive smooth now. No more clunking. Yeah. I mean, it's really loud still, but like this is normal Jeep loudness. Yep. Yeah. So is that anything abnormal? Welcome to pee life. <laughs> Anyways, that's it. Peace. <laughs>